morning school. To begin this, our weekly assembly, will you please stand for prayer? Almighty God, who seest and hearest our every thought, and even now seest Sharon Wilkins whispering in the back row, and longest for her to pay attention now, and I mean now, thou art to be praised because of thine exceeding... Lewis, do your tie-up and see me after assembly, holiness and greatness. Make us thy respectful and obedient children, always ready to obey the rules that thou hast set through the ministrations of those teachers who have given their lives to serve us, despite pathetically poor pay and conditions which fall far short of comparable employment in the rest of the civilised world. Particularly, we ask thee to show those who have been smoking in the toilets the error of their ways and make them put their cigarettes in the bin outside my office at 11am so that there need not be a detention on Friday afternoon. And God of compassion, whose mercy and forgiveness are new every morning, grant that the message will penetrate the thick skulls of year eight, so that if I catch them once more drawing in such a lewd manner on Mrs Davis's blackboard, there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth and their punishment will know no end. We commit to thee the endeavours of the football B team in their last match of the season. Thou teachest us that it is not the winning that counts, but the way we play. So we ask thee to convict our sweeper, Hacker Shinwell, of that if the opposition gets near the penalty area or I shall want words with him. May the team play above their station, Lord God. Turn our B team into Amen. Amen.